Kim. Push up. Karen tries to patch things up with Kim. I don't want to get into this with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? So, so now you want, you want to be in my face? No, I just I'm sorry. I don't care. I just didn't. I really don't care. I She's not in the mood of no. talking. Just I don't want. I don't want. Karen, I don't want. I don't want. I don't want, I don't have to deal with okay, you. This is what I don't want, no, I don't want Kim. an explanation from you. I really don't want to deal with you right now. Leave Kim alone, Karen, leave Kim listen, alone. F the f okay, and you listen, the Okay, you leave Kim alone. Leave it. She doesn't want to talk to you. Listen, don't push please, me. Give me space. Please, please. Don't talk, don't push it's me. Of your don't push give me, Karen. Space, Karen, Karen, don't push me or don't push space. me. Excuse me, don't push listen, me. Move. I said, don't push me. What move. is wrong with you? Move. Millicent. Kim, listen to me. Can you listen to me? Let me talk to Kim. Karen, I'm trying to talk you're to you and you're not listening to me. All of you. She doesn't want to talk. I'm not your friend. I've never yeah. been your friend. You're not my friend, I get it. I've never been your I friend. I get it. But so all I just, just need to say is... leave me alone. If you don't please want to play with leave me, me, I will alone. not play with you. Please leave Can me alone. Can I finish? Okay. It's just a week. It's Kim, check it. Please, you're invading my privacy. I need to get... This is a toilet. We don't Kim, need to Kim, do this. Kim, Kim, no, please. You said something. Please, Karen. Please. You said when I was just... Please, Karen. Please. Leave what? me alone. You have to go to the chat room now. Me? Yeah. Why? Why? Millie. Karen warns Millicent to mind her own business. Millie. You said something. You said I need to talk to Kim. Whatever I have, you see me. In. And when I choose a time, I want to talk to her. I want to talk to her. If Kim is my friend, you understand? It had nothing to do with you. My friend, you're my friend, but you're being a nuisance. But it had nothing to do with you, Yeah, you're being a nuisance. Stay away. Let me I talk. I will stay away. Thank but you. But you're being a nuisance. Oh, okay. Millie, don't do that again. No. If Kim has a problem, she will really? tell me. Not you. You're not Kim. When two people have an argument, no, you Karen, away. No, Karen, you're not Kim. It's not about you. No, you're not. But if you're going to talk to me, use a polite language. You cannot use a polite language. Don't I told you, Millie, please. Don't shut up. I keep telling you, please, Millie. No, don't bring me a stress. I've had you. I will not interfere. Karen will not give up. Why won't you leave? Kim, stop me. Kim. I know what you want from me. Oh, no. You want me to slap you so that I can go no, like Lotus. No, no, no. That's what you want from me. But you know you, what? You I'm know not going to... Like no, you know I'm you know, like I'm not going to slap you okay. because at home we don't fight. Okay, Just I, let me you, go. Can you lie Big down? brother, I really need my space. I need my space. You need, you need to hire a bodyguard for me because this person won't leave me alone. She won't leave me alone. What does she want from me? I left this room for her. Why is she in my space? I go to the toilet, she's there. I can't even do a doo-doo in this house without somebody following me. Time for the arena games. Big Brother surprises housemates with karaoke. It's karaoke, yes, guys. We want karaoke. karaoke. Your, what, what, Let's sing, baby. Yes. Sing. Okay. Welcome. Hello. Oh Welcome to karaoke. Yeah, I'm about to sing. Okay, I want to sing. Okay, what songs are there? Whoa, whoa. Now you wanna act like you don't know what to do. Can you keep up, baby boy? Let me lose my breath. You're a dime, that's not enough. It's a shame you don't even know what you want. Things get out of hand as housemates fight over the karaoke remote. Give it to them. Please, 
I just can't stand it. It's better you just come and take this thing and take it out because it's just so unfair. I'm just getting pissed off seeing the way they are behaving and the way they are treating Karen. This is just not fair. It's not a fault for her to be what she is. The best thing is I can do is just understand her you know, and try to just do right things, not to push her to do the wrong thing. It's not fair. I will take this out. Karen, can you shut up and listen? Okay. That's not funny, Nibble. Not hey, I'm allowed to go after the food. Don't take your tip out because you can't. No, 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 wait. Don't no, wait. pick on me. No, no, wait. D after. Don't involve me. Don't involve me. Do not involve me. Laugh, I will laugh if I want to. Who are you to tell me not to laugh, you know? Okay. Who are you to tell me not to laugh? I want to do it for me. You know what? You can all do whatever the f you want. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Break it if you want. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Be mad. Stand. Honey, I'm done. I want to You know, it's only fair that Karen sing. It is only fair that Karen sing. Yeah. Yeah, you sang, let Karen sing. You sang, let Karen sing. Kim and Karen put their issues aside and unite in song. Yes, we are going to sing now. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, the remote, yeah. Wow. I don't know this song. You <laughs> Housemates receive messages from home, except for Lou Clay. Mom, try to mind on mom, try to we miss you. We pray for you every day. You're doing so well. Who would have thought it? My mother! Oh my my mother! Bedin tamaleshi, yigna shayzosh barchi, melka medin. Hote! Mimi! That's my sister! Ah! Mimi! 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 Trust me, you're a winner already. Jean! I got some nice stuff Drink waiting well for, for you, player. Drink well but for me. First things first, <laughs> money. Drink okay. well for me. Hi, Mama. This is Mr. Chanda. We're missing you. Everybody's missing you. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Lindell. You are a joy to watch. You are a joy to see. And I hope the rest of Africa sees what we all see. Mm -hmm. We wish you luck. Booyah. Wicked. Oh my God. Hi. Hi. You're doing so, so well. I'm so, so proud of you. I love you. I love you. I miss you. Can't wait to see you, but not just yet. Take your time. <laughs> see you at the end of the game. I love you. Say, say hello, Sharon. <laughs> Greetings from everybody. Can you all say Sharon O? Yeah? Sharon O. We love you. We're missing you. Nigeria is behind you. Africa is behind you. Keep being yourself. Peace. Thank you, Biggie. That was so cool. All right, well, let's move to the dirty business of the day. Vina, will you please stand? As we all know, making this decision isn't very easy because the two people are really close to me. But I hope the person understands. And I chose to swap Loom with for Karen. Housemates, when you hear your name, please stand. Vimbai, Lomwe, please stand. Lomwe, you're safe, Vimbai. Please leave the house now.
Wendell, please stand. Kim, please stand as well. Interesting. Kim, please leave the house. Wendell, you're safe. Annie, please stand. <laughs> Luke Clay, please stand. Millicent, <laughs> <laughs> please leave the house. It was a moment that defined their lives. You haven't been here. You have no idea what is going on here. The Walker family is back. We are studio $50 million deal. Mom, how are you letting this happen? Well, what would you want me to do? Be the mother you were when I left. We need to be walkers. Brothers and sisters, Thursdays at 6.30 Central African time on Mnet. Mo Abudu, Africa's Queen of Talk, is back with another exciting season of Moments with Mo. 24, and you are running the first air ambulance service in West Africa. Adjusting my phone black. So you see yourself as a black yes. person? Sex is a blessing from God. What is beauty? Until the court decides that. Um, it's not gambling, it's gaming. Oh, that's like a that nicer thing. word. <laughs> Moments with Mo on Mnet East at 2200 CAT every Monday and exclusive to Mnet. You've seen it all before. Fingerprints, phone calls, facts, photos, furries, fights, frequencies, fast cars, planes, fragile. Phantoms, flashbacks, fumes, flashlights, free fall, even fish burn. But what we haven't seen. Expect the unexpected in CSI Season 11, Thursdays at 8.30 Central African Time. I was very upset. Um, because I didn't know what Africa had decided. And, of course, the two of them, Sharon O and Lomwe, being so close to me, I had to make a decision where I knew the person that I swapped would really understand, and they wouldn't take it as me just, you know, having... just because I can swap someone, I swap them. And I think Lomwe was the best person for that. No hard feelings whatsoever. I'm just grateful for the fact that, you know, um, Africa kept me in here. I was relieved that she saved me. 
but at the same time, I wanted to go and party with her, Millicent. So I'm, I was, I'm grateful she saved me. Seeing Millicent walk out was one of the hardest things I had to face in this house. I'm going to miss Millicent giving me advice and, of course, her arguing with Karen and then them making up. Kim, <laughs> I don't even know what to say with Kim. Probably miss her, you know, sudden outburst of, Kimberly from Zambia! Hey, Kimberly from Zambia! Sad, because Vumbai left. I so wanted her to be in this final. The house feels very empty and, like, it's more quiet. Uh, you see, the power in an environment like this, even though you make friends, but there's the ones you know in your heart, you don't want to see them again. <laughs> there's no, you understand what I mean? There's yeah. no two ways about it. Me, I can't come mean. to you mm. and waste my breath and say to you, Vina, I want to see you again. <laughs> if I do want to see you, or I don't want to okay. see you. I'd rather not talk at all. If I don't talk, that's how you know I don't want to see you again. Mm. I've told this one, I want to see her and a few others. I don't just wait my breath. Mm. <laughs> it's like I said to her, there are some people that won't even talk to other people when we leave here. Keep talking, there'll be no talking. Be if party. I see you and I watch highlights, for some mm. reason I, I see a newspaper, mm -hmm. a newspaper article where I read something about what you did to me mm. and I see you again. Mm. Listen, deep sea. Because violence is not good. <laughs> but me and you, we will sit down and talk nice. I really don't see anybody as a threat. I see them all as literally my friends. My biggest threats. Um, uh, Luke Clay, Wendell. Um, as far as the ladies is concerned, Vina. It's probably Vina and, and Lomwe. Because they've been up so many times and they've been saved so many times. Nibbles and Sharon O and Luke Clay. Why am I forgetting Luke Clay? Luke Clay. Nobody. Nobody. I'm not saying this because I'm being overconfident. No. But I think Luke Clay is going to win. You never know. Whatever it is, we've come so far. Each and every one of us have entertained Africa in a different way. You understand? So I'm not going to sit there and go, oh, that's my competition. You are my competition. That's my competition. When I came into this game, I didn't come here to start looking who is my competition and who is not. We've come so far. But you know, if this is the main house, it's only me and Lukele that is left. Yeah. You know that, right? But I don't think there was a main house. I think both houses were the same. That glove you took, this is the main house. Can you see the decoration of it? But we never know, yeah? You don't know. Whatever happens, We've come so far. I just can't wait for that day. Lomwe wins a MacBook Pro for his Eva walk. <laughs> well done, Lomwe. Congratulations. Lo. Sometimes taking part can be winning. Whatever it is that you've taken part in, and even if you don't win, at least you have made an impact on a couple of people's lives. But you get the MacBook. The Mac Eva Mac walk. I haven't, uh, I haven't checked it. Yeah, I, know, I think where, he gets the Mac. There's many ways to win than just getting the money. The fact that um, you are on this platform, you can, you can do so many things that will, in the end, um, show you as a winner. Didn't I win every week, though? I don't know. Maybe they didn't add, like, the time it reset. Congrats. Yeah, yeah. What's that? yeah. He got yeah. a MacBook. Now you can do all your Mac music Mac. and all that yeah. crap on that. Can I check all your whack envelope? beats, Lomwe. MacBook. Like, I hate losing in anything. I always try and make sure that I, that I win or try my best at least. But I would say that taking part is, is more important than winning. Yeah. Big Brothers compiled 28 questions for the housemates to answer. One at a time, housemates must pick a question out of the bag stand behind the podium and answer the question honestly. If the housemate audience think that the housemate who is behind the podium is not telling the truth, they may deal with the situation in whatever way they see fit. You just basically pick one paper with a question. If somebody was describing my personality, what would they say? Okay. I would describe my personality as a simple guy 
I am a quiet storm. I am a quiet storm that does not like being disturbed. Boo! And if you disturb him, there shall be issues. If you, your best friend, and your parents were about to die, and you would only pick one person to live, would it be you, your best friend, or your parents? Why? Question mark. Okay, this one is thoughtful. I can always make friends. But then again, I would pick my parents because if my dad is alive and I have the opportunity to save him, I will. And I'll pick my mom as well because I want to relieve my childhood, like get to know them more since I didn't stay with them that much. So I'll pick my parents. Would you be willing to reduce your life expectancy by 10 years to become extremely attractive or famous? Why? Wow. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> <sighs> like the George Bush situation. I'm being honest, yes, I would. Hmm? Right, huh? ten years, I would. What is the one quality or feature you would like to change about yourself? Mm. Your height? No. <laughs> what did she say? Your height. I think. Nothing. Probably to talk less. Mm. Here, here. <laughs> That's it, Pina. To talk less. Okay. How do you want to be remembered after you die? <laughs> if I'm remembered at all, <laughs> I would like to be the person that makes a difference. Um, just a lady with a purpose. Just not somebody that just came and went, but... <laughs> <laughs> Matthew, I will show you back. Next. Do you believe in love? <laughs> Yeah, I should have, uh, should have asked definitely. me that question. Definitely. I mean, I've been in a relationship for uh, eight years right now, and for those who are seeing out there, mm -hmm. if I may say, honey, <laughs> there's that Mr. Right there waiting for you. <laughs> so, yeah, there's true love out there. I believe love conquers all. <laughs> if you get up one day and see that you have turned into a girl or boy, <laughs> what will you do? You will play with his boobs the whole day. Oh what will I do? Be honest. <laughs> be honest, well, I just hope that if I did turn into a girl, it would be a hat girl. You know? Boo. Yeah. Boo. I'm not gonna... <laughs> what would you do for the whole day? I would, I, would, I would do what girls do. What do girls do? <laughs> I touch myself. Huh? You touch what yourself. Do touch yourself. You know, you're a girl. Yeah, I don't I mean, know. You touch yourself. You don't know. Mm -mm. Touch yourself. If I'll go out there and be the hardest chick out there. If I was a know? guy, I'm gonna f all the girls. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Yo, if you got the spark, basketball music and dance, Sprite Triple Slam is back from July 1st to August 7th. Enugu, Kalawa, Abuja, and Lagos. For basketball, come solo. Show your skills and call swag. For music, you rap against the best in your city. And for dance, just form a crew of two people and become a part of Sprite Ultimate Showdown. You register, sex category, state name, and age to 33665. Or get more info on Facebook.com slash Triple Slam. Sprite, the spark. In Africa, Malaria kills a child every 35 seconds. Children miss out on school. Workers go absent from work. General productivity drops. Malaria costs Africa more than 12 billion US dollars every year in lost GDP. Bayer provides effective and sustainable solutions in the elimination of malaria. We develop new vector control tools, technologies and continually research improvements in their efficacy towards sustainable vector control.
Do you know that your DS TV decoder allows you to control the way your picture is displayed on your TV screen? Here's what to do. If you have a newer model decoder, press Shift and TV Guide on your remote to access the arc or aspect ratio settings. Then select one that works best for your TV. If you have an older model decoder, you'll need to press the menu button. Select Advanced Options, followed by TV Installation for TV1, and then select the aspect ratio and viewing mode setting of your choice. Owners of widescreen TVs need to ensure that their TV is not set to automatically adjust the picture, as this will clash with your decoder settings. Enjoy your viewing. DSTV, so much more for you. Where's Allie? It's Allie? I think I heard her scream. The secret they want to forget will become a reality. They live to regret. She's gone, but she's everywhere. I'm still here. And, and I, I know everything. everything. The truth may be beautiful, but so are lies. Pretty Little Liars, Mondays at 8, Central African Time. As the final week gathers momentum and everybody's focusing on which housemate will win the game, Big Brother would like housemates to take a closer look at each other. Taking a close look will take the form <laughs> of observing a fellow housemate's features and painting a very special type of portrait. Each housemate must choose a fellow housemate to paint. There was a situation with the whole picking who to paint. Karen felt as if she was being left out because she was the last one, to, you know, to to um, find out who she's painting or being painted by. Let me draw me. I can't draw. Hmm? I can't draw though. I'm doing shine. So what am I going to draw it? So no, you only it draw. You only, you just have fun. Somebody needs to draw me. Just have fun. Yeah. I am not a talented artist. I will not claim to be a talented artist. All I am is just a talented talkist. I'm not sure about that. But. The wrap. Ten minutes. It's done. Charles, I'm, not sure. I'm, not sure. Charles, I'm not good at this, bro. All of you guys I'm don't really do it. It's just to keep other people in the other house. Yeah? That's how it is, right? Oh, Karen, it's not the same. <laughs> what? Okay, I'll draw you. Karen, I'll draw you. Just pay fun. <laughs> Finally, Wendell comes to Karen's rescue. I'm the furthest thing away from being a talented artist. I would say I'm most probably one of the worst artists there is. <laughs> they said I'm the one prostar, uh, prank star ever. I want to redeem myself. It's going down. It's my birthday. My third birthday today. Baby birthday. Thank you, Vina, for the jello fries. Thank you, guys. I'll make you jello fries for dinner. Thank she you. She not even say anything. Okay, uh, Karen, I'll lay, I'll lay your Back bed today. Back do my bed. I'll lay your bed. 57 shots. We need to get Karen, I'll lay your bed. Bring the, that's why I didn't want to drink today. Maybe later. It's Karen's birthday, and Karen didn't tell anybody that it was her birthday today, so she took honey by surprise. Okay, guys, we have a party. You know that. I, I told Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, I'm here, you're my husband. You always tell me he's my husband. You don't know sh. Hey, hey. I knew you were turning 27. I just didn't know when. You kept quiet now. Where's the today? Oh, no. I don't even know your wife's birthday. Oh, yeah. I apologize, my wife. Oh. <laughs> I beg you. Why don't you tell us yesterday? You together with us. Because I've been singing, I've been singing and telling you guys. So maybe you guys will remember. Just like remember everybody's birthday. You surprised them. Tell Big Brother what you would do if you won the big prize. Oh, jeez, Big Brother. I really hoped you wouldn't ask this question. I don't want to think along those lines. 
Ah, uh, you know what, Biggie, I'm not even going to start thinking that far ahead of me. Um, but wow, wow, I don't even want to think about it if I do. And ah! <laughs> oh my When, if I win, I'm going to be shocked. With me, you never know. I might start laughing and crying. <laughs> I don't know. And I'd run around screaming and shouting, I won! I did it! Yay! I actually amount to something in this world. Wait, on this continent! If I win, maybe I'll stay a day longer. And then me and Big Brother will chat the whole day. Um, I don't always get my hopes up or anything like that. So, yeah, as I said, I'm just going to take each day as it comes. If I win the money, um, I'm definitely going to venture into entrepreneurship. I'm going to be shocked, like, shock, shock, shock. And I'm shock, shock, shock. And then I realize I'll be asking everybody, I just won. I'll be very humbled, very happy, and very ecstatic. So any emotions that comes along those lines, definitely. <laughs> yeah, I would cry, <laughs> like I always do, tears of joy. What I would plan to do open up my own radio station. Yeah. Wow, um, I think, I think the pressure's on and everybody's just, yeah, just very, 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 um, I, th I think they just can't wait to get out and, you know, just, it's just been so long and this week is just dragging, so, I mean, like, there's not that much conversation and, Now, Big Brother is curious. Okay. How are housemates entertaining one another? <laughs> okay, as you can see, if you do happen to glance outside, um, the boys are playing ping pong. Uh, that's all they do. Sharon Orr would either be in the kitchen <laughs> making food, washing up, or singing. Me and Hani tend to do the singing or the sleeping, which is what we siesta sisters do. We sleep and sing. You're done for night, buddy. <laughs> Karen, on the other hand, she's either dancing to the music, you know, or annoying people. <laughs> Honey, yeah? Because you don't have some cook and Sprite, like two cook and Sprite, just to put it on the table. But I also think it's her birthday. I'm not sure. I don't know why I think it's her birthday today. Mm. Anyway, yeah. Big hey, brother, I've been punking my housemate today that today's my birthday. I just want to know how well they know me. I've been singing and singing, telling them my birthday is April 6th, and yet they still buy it that it's my birthday. Wendell puts extra effort into Karen's birthday. This can't even fit on my <laughs> Did you really cook that for my birthday or did you cook that for the house? Yeah, see, I also have to... Uh, mm -hmm. For real? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, do you really dress for my serious? birthday or you dress yeah. for yourself? I dress for me. Thank you. Lomu, huh? did you really that? You, did you really do that Vienna for me or for yourself? <sighs> you know, I did it for y'all. Thank you. How you well you guys know me. know me? You guys have been pumped. Okay. It's not my birthday yeah, today, mother. <laughs> <laughs> Wendell is not impressed by Karen's revelation. Have you already told me when your birthday see, was? See, look, see, look at That's me. That's why I wanted you to do, do the shots. Look, look, at <laughs> look, look at your boobs. Look at your boobs. Look at your boobs being all hurt. It's a good thing you cooked for me. You never cooked for me. One. My darling nibbles. I know you guys love me now. You know, I just do it for your birthday this afternoon. So I decided, no, let me cook for Karen. 
But it doesn't and matter. And you decided to start eating red meat for your birthday? You know, I think I need to think. I need to release some stress now. Right? Come on, release it on me now. No. Release it on me. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Nibus and his drama. You know, there's a joke, and pushing it too far is pushing it too far. <laughs>
that's what I think. Yeah, it should be like that. Let's have fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. Biggie surprises the housemates. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> the head's housemates get their turn drumming in the arena. People that will be glued to their TV that day. I had to this she would just be crying. Yes. She'll just stop. be crying. You won't stop crying. <laughs> Literally. She'll be in shock. Me, I am too gangster to cry, man. I stopped crying a long time ago. The gangster is back, so I'm not going to cry ever. <laughs> Lomi, Lomi will just be cool. Why you're looking at him back? If you Lomi, Lomi will just be go he's jump to in sleep, the jacuzzi. See, he wants to smile. Because he's listening to everything with you. <laughs> see? <laughs> and you can just tell when he wants to smile. You can tell. I would definitely say that my chances are high because obviously I'm still in here and I've, 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 uh, there were times when I could have been out of here. But if I see, if Loman wins this thing, we just be cool, uh, cool, calm and collected. You no, he's going to jump in the jacuzzi. He's going <laughs> to run, jump in the jacuzzi. You cry. I'll jump in the jacuzzi for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Vina and Hani feel that it's important for a girl to win. It's like, it's not about how many votes you get in your country, because your country will always class as right. one vote, yeah. right? And then I thought, Sharon O might take this if a girl was to win this. No offense to any other girl in this house, but I feel like Sharon O might take this because, A, she has toured around East Africa. People know who she is. Millicent will be out there campaigning for her. So that's her Kenyan votes coming in, right? She already has the Ugandan votes. Malawi, she's gonna, F Felicia's going to be out there voting for her as well. But as well as all Kenyans way. and one Nigerian votes for you, it's the same thing. What do you mean? One Nigerian from Kenya votes for you. Mm -hmm. Or well, one Kenyan from Kenya votes for you. It's mm -hmm. the same thing. Class is a one vote. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Only uses that one vote. When it's a tie, you get to counting. Uh, the winning would be really, really good for me. For but, babe, but I'm not thinking about the money. Do you get? I'm thinking more along the lines of being the first female to take this back to Nigeria. Do you get? I think it applies to every female in this house. In this house. <laughs>
The morning was great because we gave our personal trainer a nice surprise. We all just wanted to thank you for the time that we spent with you. And then we have a gift for you. But you gotta come with us. You need to close your eyes. Because Wendell's bringing the gift, so you need to close your eyes. We decided to uh, call him outside, and I'll be hiding outside of a hose pipe. And we'll spray him down, because it's going to be our last time I've seen him in the house. So we thought we'll give him a nice going away present. All right, come, come out. Wendell, do you have the gift? Okay, stand here. No, 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 yeah, face that way. No, 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 don't hold me, he's, he's gonna bring it to you. So just relax. You can't see, right? Yeah. Okay, just hold it, hold it. He was just laughing, he just didn't even take it seriously, he didn't take it to heart, he knew it was a joke and he was happy and he said goodbye, of course that was sad. One, two, three, Booyah! <laughs> That's our way of saying goodbye. Sitting down on the sofa, I am talking, doing whatever I have to, actually not talking, just being quiet, drinking. Karen and Sharon talking about food, whatever, and Karen says something and I comment, I'm like, okay, well, we are in Africa, blah, blah, blah. And obviously, she was quick to prank everyone and to joke with everybody. So let me also joke with her, of which it's actually quite apparent that Karen does not take jokes very well. Exactly. Bina, what are you saying? We are in Africa. I said there are children in Africa, and I mean outside of this house. Well, this house is in Africa. I know. We know you know a lot. Can I just do like I don't know? Can a girl be dumb if you want to be dumb? A girl can only be dumb for a certain amount of time before it starts being very dumb. I don't know what that girl's problem is, but I've realized that we are both from really, really different worlds. Today Why is that is my to do day. With me? Everybody else in I this said house, you Karen. particularly do but not. Karen. You're today. forgetting that there are I other people in this you. house. Like, you Five other people. <gasps> you're so why do you you're pick too on intelligent. Me? I was I'm not intelligent. Why are you talking Karen. about you? Okay, I am not intelligent. They're holding. But since when you I say I'm you intelligent, you thank you very much, Karen. <laughs> thank you very <laughs> much. I'm intelligent. Thanks you're for you're telling me. Thanks for telling the whole Africa I'm intelligent, Karen. If you're going to pick on me about something, do it when it's just me and you. Don't be doing it when everybody Why else is sitting here. Why are you putting your mouth in my conversation, Bina? Yeah? Did I ask you? Karen, to Sharon but there's no need for you to sit there and I go, nobody's going to f*** my day you. up. You. That goes to you, Vina. Of course, my morning will not, my day will not be anything without Karen yapping away. You're Listen. insecure about your skin. You're insecure about your height. Everything. This is not I'm even funny. This is not Say it, Vina. Say oh, it. Oh, my you guys. God. Obviously, you have Can issues you, with my oh skin. My you have issues you have. with my height. You have. Yeah? You, you have. have all that. My skin is. Uh, oh, thank both you of much. you, shut up. I'm quite happy both with your skin. Bina. Thank you very much. Bina. Keep quiet. Just keep quiet. <laughs> Don't make me mad. You are irritating me. I oh, will not wow. Me. Yes. Really? You are. Yes. And it's now that you're actually finding that because out. You well, I'm sorry. Sh Tell you because that is me a hundred percent. Yeah, right. At this point, people are trying to step on me, and me being me, is rather I voice it out, they pretend and go, Oh, I'm not gonna say anything because we're coming to the end of the show. Please. So get used to it. Karen, oh, wait, please. we only have a couple let, more days. Let, let it go. Let it go. And I'll tell you now. Say it. Enough. Say please it. Please just let it go. Honey, please let her get out of her system. I'm she has so it. much to please. say. Whatever it is, just let it go. Be when you come down, that. you'll talk about it when you both she talk. Right that. now, you're just doing stuff that you're not supposed to. Just stop it. <laughs> <laughs> no, because it's the end of the show. Nobody wants to say anything. Nobody wants to quarrel. <laughs> quarrel, be yourself. Housemates, here's your final chance to pose for the viewers. Pull out all the stops for the fun you've had during the Amplified Weekly Tasks. Big Brother's provided all the props you need to create stunning amplified photographs themed according to your weekly tasks. And the clown oh, shoes? The babies! It's, no, that's not Wazers. Who's is that? Uh, Miguel. <laughs> this reminds me of the glass house with no lights.
All right, I'd just like to start by saying good evening to Africa. On this task, we're told to say why we think we should win the $200,000. Um, well, my reason is because um, growing up, my mom worked so hard at everything she did. Like, we went through school, having no school fees at times, having no dinner on the table at times. And no matter what, she always got up, did something, and managed to make that money come through or whatever. I would just like to get something going for myself when I get back home, and that would be like a great boost to like get myself on the road and running and like maybe when she wants to retire I can help her out. I don't think I should be saying that I deserve to win the big prize because I don't know Africa is the one that decides whether or not I deserve to win the big prize but if I do win the big prize it will be a great honor for me to take this home. From day one till today I have not changed for no one not anybody and I feel consistency is the key to winning well I have been then obviously um um, a people's person, everyone knows me back home, even with the little that I have, I will definitely share it. In terms of why I deserve to win, I don't know, I guess only Africa knows, because at the end of the day, they know all our hearts, so they shall decide. Thank you. There's a saying, you give a man a fish today, he'll be wanting you to give him a fish tomorrow, but you'd know, rather teach a person how to fish. I want to be an inspiration to my community and show them that it doesn't matter if you come from the bottom, you can make it to the top, so long as you have motivation, self-determination, from rags to riches. And with that, all I can say next is, may the best man or woman win. Africa, you are the eyes and you are the voice. Oh, my English is correct. At the end of the day, you are here to decide who's going to win. I'm not going to lie, if this money is going to fall on my hands, I'm going to be very glad. Thank you, Africa. It was a pleasure. I hope you enjoy watching me. You've seen me in this house, you've seen me grow, you've seen me basically for the past 13 weeks I was under your eyes and I hope I was, I've been, thank you, I've been good enough for you to save me and for you to keep me into this house and I'm grateful for it and hopefully that will be good enough right now as well. Thank you Ethiopia, thank you Africa. Housemaids. For the very last time, good evening. Good evening, Yuki. Whatever, man, whatever. <laughs> Housemates, you have wrapped, rocked, you have clowned, cleaned, and cursed. From Big Brother, thank you for taking part, and for Big Brother, you are all winners. Yay! Thank you. Oh, yes. Thank you. That means a lot, baby. Yes. For the very last time, <laughs> the storeroom <laughs> is open. Oh. Yeah! We got the Nicholas. calendars. Congratulations. Certificate of recognition. Oh, the so oh, oh, my God! 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 Oh, my Goodbye, big brother. Can't you come up with something else? <laughs> I don't want to say goodbye. <laughs> yeah, I don't want no tomatoes, please. Karen cooks a special dinner in honor of Biggie. Hey, hey, hey. Guys, put the meat in us. Just make a toast to big brother. Thank you very much. For the past three, almost three months, there is a voice that tells you, do this, do that. I know sometimes, because I hate, I hate, I hate rules and I hate others, but I, but I follow yours because you're part of this house, you're part of the game, and now you're not part of my life. Although I've never seen Big Brother, but it's been mm. part of my life. To me, it's like the dad I've never had. I told you this upstairs. I drank my and he really, he really touched me when he said he's not going to be here anymore. But on behalf of Big Brother, even though he's invisible and <laughs> <laughs> Just, we just uh, want to thank him, and wherever he is, 
It's been great chatting to you too. I'm gonna miss you. And uh, you know, hopefully one day we can link up, you know, for a drink or something. It's been great. But people, I don't want to leave the purple chair. Thank you, Corin. You may leave the chat room. Uh, I'm even sweating, big brother. I'm sweating everywhere. I'm sweating. Uh -huh.